summoned you here for a purpose. Hey YouTube world, Washman here, back again for another review. Um, before we get on with it, um, I haven't been on YouTube for a few days. I was pretty busy. I went out Friday night and got really drunk and sat I just had too much of a hangover to even eat, let alone <laughs> watch YouTube videos. But I've got a bit of a backlog of videos to watch, so I will get round to it, all of you, anyone that I'm subscribed to. So, um, sorry for not watching, and this vote bot thing's bloody stupid, I believe, anyway. Never seen anything so stupid in my life. But, um, <clears throat> yeah, so, get on with the review, I suppose. Um, I'm going to try it this way, just to see what people think, and whether I like it, or whatever, but... Today we are going to do Takari Takara, sorry, book collection, um, animated coloured star screen. I paid twenty pound for this, no box and no stickers. The person never put any stickers on it for some reason. But um, also, what was failed to tell me was there's yellowing on this section here and there. Uh, there's yellowing on the back of the wings. You can't see it but it, it's really it's like goldy yellow. It don't show up at all on the camera. Don't ask me why. But it doesn't. And also on the back uh, this is hard to get used to the angles. Back of here. And, that. and the reason why is when it was in robot mode obviously the person stored it on the windowsill and that caused it to have yellow in, in the places of the robot so you know this bit's back behind its head and it, it was yellow on that um, the back of here would be the back of the body which would be in the sun so you know and, and this isn't much older than five, four, been out about four years I suppose this star screen maybe more I can't remember exactly the date but yeah so that was pretty disappointing but isn't it a beauty I love the new the colour, the lightness. It's so, it's so nice, you know. Proper, and I like the new the labels on the wings. You know, usually the G1 Star Screen just has a big thick red sticker that runs along the facing of the wing. But um, also, this has our oh, silver stripes on the cockpit. It has the painted on all Decepticon logos, but they like. Um, Wolfgang, Wolfgang said that I don't like the fact that the, the um, Decepticon logos are the wrong way around on the wings. The Encore ones are not that way around. They actually fix that. I don't mind these. I prefer. I, I sometimes I prefer them to the stickers because they're neater. But uh, I can see why people like the stickers. Who anyone likes Chrome, don't they? So uh, missiles fire. You know, press the button, they fire. So it's because it's Japanese, so I gotta get used to this. The screen's over there, and the the lens is there, and I keep, you know, it's like when you lot say, "There's a tag over there." No, over there. No, there. Mm, there. I think it's there. There. I'm not sure. I just, you know, but I keep having to hold it over to the left to be in the right. So it's quite strange for me, but. Here he is. Um, here he is with the other Japanese star screen, the Henke classic star screen. Um, it's got slightly darker bluer fins. They don't show up too well on there, but you know you can see it's darker. It's not quite as dark as the Generation One, but you know. So you know, all I have to transform this guy. You just take the wheel off and the missile launchers, and you can take the wings off as well. Like so, you got it. Just this piece. Then you uh, flip these round to the front. Flip the feet down. Pop her up in the arms. Flip the head around and back. Then you take the wings and you put them. I'll do it in a minute. Hold on. Put the missiles. Oh yeah, I forgot to show you the fists. This Takari one, Takara. One. Sorry, this is the lazy British way of saying it. 
I don't mean it. Um, comes with fists to to accept this little bad boy, which goes with G1 start screen. There it is Megatron. Very cool. Uh, doesn't come apart apart from that bit comes off there. That's it. So Starscreen can hold him, hold it. Not very well, but it does hold it. Put the missile launchers on. Now stick the wings on. This is where the wings are really annoying, having the stickers around the wrong way. Because in robot mode, they are upside bloody down. What a nightmare. Eh? But, um. There he is. As I said, no stickers whatsoever. Ah, he's put some stickers on the eyes. Red ones. But. So, yeah, all the yellowing is there. Sorry. On the back of the wings. On the back of the body. And on the top of his head. So, that has been on a windowsill with the back facing pure sunlight and he, it has yellowed it in that short amount of years you know he could have only had it on the windowsill for a year for all I know but I didn't get the box with this I, like I said I paid 20 quid which is a very good price um, so there is G1 star screen in animated colours I will show you with the gun in quickly before I finish the video right to put the gun in the hand you pull these two bits apart then the blue piece goes in the hole on the fist like so you could just have it like that but then you can put this this piece on the bottom of the hand which doesn't look too good and then it means you've got to move the wing out the way as well but there is G1 star screen holding Megatron. Yeah, it makes a, it means that you can't have this wing as far forward because this black bit here pushes on it. But if you take that black bit off, then you can have the wing where you normally have it. But so this is the Takara book collection, animated coloured star screen. I recommend this to everyone, even if you've got G1 star screen. This this is a Bessie. I bet you twenty quid you put the. G1 star screen back in the box or away and you'll display this guy. Probably could, it is a very dear figure in the box with the DVD and all the stuff that comes of it. I have got the Optimus Prime Fist as well. Everything was complete. It just didn't have the box so I got it for cheap and it didn't say about the yellow in which your eBay's um, a problem for things like that. People don't want to tell you the truth because they want to get as much as they can from but there you go. Hope you enjoyed this review with me in the picture. I uh, I don't normally do it this way. This is a first attempt. If people don't like it, I will do it the other way. You know, there's less detail in this way. The way I do it on the other way is a proper toy review. You can see it clearly, and this is just, you know. So there is Takara book collection generation one star screen in animated colours. Hope you enjoyed the review. Thanks for watching. I'll be back again soon with another one. Mushman and out. Peace. Would you like to beg for your lives? It sometimes helps, but not often.